This is Kevin Gogish, and today I am joined uh, by uh, Michael Guthrie. Uh, Michael, can you tell us a little bit about uh, your history with Clean Harbors, how long you've been here, and, and the role that you serve? Um, I started here in 1993, February 1st, and uh, I am a driver trainer. I uh, operate every piece of equipment that uh, Clean Harbors has, whatever they need the job done i go do it wow since 1993 and uh training drivers as well as operating vehicles um i imagine you've got to see a lot of the country and a lot of different people can you tell me an interesting story of either a person or a place that you've seen um there's so many different stories because uh i've been fortunate enough to go to 36 states here and uh canada um it's just, uh, to me, it's just amazing the difference in states. Um, uh, the people act uh, different in Texas than they do in Minnesota. Uh, the same way f- to Maryland. Uh, every, every state is almost its own little separate country. Uh, Pennsylvania is a perfect example. The way we talk in western pennsylvania is different than the way they talk in northern pennsylvania uh it's just such a surreal uh country that we live in we uh we're definitely very blessed well michael you and i you know know each other a little bit you know i'm originally from wisconsin but i also spent some time in that other part of uh pennsylvania in the philadelphia area and i'd agree completely with you it's such a treat to be able to see this great nation of ours and sounds like you've been able to spend a little bit of time in canada as well if you were to give any advice to someone considering a career at clean harbors or or maybe starting a career as a driver what advice would you give them i would say you better be ready to do a job that you have to um think on your feet uh we don't haul stuff that is virgin product where you pull in and they just put a hose down in your trailer um when you're pulling a back trailer you might be doing a job that's 100 200 feet of hose and pouring down rain below zero temperatures it's always a different challenge for every day and you need to be mentally and physically prepared for that kind of uh, conditions uh, at the company. And especially like myself, and I'm not uh, different than a lot of drivers here that were hired back when I was hired, um, you had to be multifaceted. You had to be able to pull um, every piece of equipment because we didn't have very many drivers back then. We probably had less than, uh, probably less than 100 drivers, uh, maybe even 75 drivers. So you had to be very versatile um, in what you did. Well, that's amazing. Clearly, you are a adaptable, versatile person yourself, able to think on your feet. Want to thank you for your years of service, uh, not only during national. Uh, truck driver appreciation week but at all times and uh, continue to be safe on the road out there michael and uh, look forward to seeing you uh, in the near future